bath, shower, and tap and toilet. Oh my goodness. And my very own weird looking sponge. <laughs> from Costa Rica. Welcome to another house tour by Ken Didi. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and if you're a returning subscriber, welcome. Before we get into today's video, I want to just point out that we went to see this house a couple of years back. The reason why I am reposting it now is that I just want to show some people um, that you can get new build houses that are much bigger we get a lot of comments sometimes people saying oh new builds are too small UK houses are too small yes we know they are small but some people can only afford a certain size of home and some people can afford the big mansions and they don't have the funds for that but I just thought I would show you guys this beautiful house um which is absolutely stunning it's massive to me it's a big house but before we get into the tour i just want to point out when i did this video my videography skills were not at par so bear with me guys i apologize in advance if i'm not uh, focusing that well in the rooms and the space but i still wanted to show you guys it's still a good video and i think some of you guys will enjoy it so yeah before we get into the full tour i want to talk about the floor plans so let's start with the first floor uh, but before i talk about the floor plans i just want to mention the house is called the spains and this particular house is no longer available at this uh, site i will still put the details of the builder um, and you can contact them in case they have any more of these houses still available at one of their other sites But anyways, let's get into it So downstairs you have a very generous living room Then you have a family area Well a family room actually because it is separate from the kitchen Then you have a kitchen slash dining And then you have a utility room um, then upstairs you have five bedrooms one of the most amazing features that they have is the glass panels and you would have seen that in the intro part of this video the master bedroom features a private walk-in dressing room and an ensuite with a separate bath and shower enclosure bedroom two three and four are fitted with wardrobes and bedroom two and three also feature an ensuite shower rooms bedroom five is a study um and you'll be you'll be able to get an opportunity to see one of my sons where we were sitting down and just having a wee chat i'll see if i can i'll include that bit in there but yeah um the spence is a luxury five bedroom home it's honestly it's truly stunning um it's just well designed well thought out it's a beautiful family home and i myself wouldn't mind owning one of these so if somebody wants to buy me this house leave me a comment or send me an email and i will accept that offer <laughs> but yeah so let's get into the tour so outside as you can see the house comes with a garage it was currently being used as a marketing suite uh, you have the brickwork and the rough casting the property you have a vestibule which is stunning it's massive then you have the glass panel and another door um, to access the entrance hallway uh, it's a decent sized space stepping into the entrance hallway but just before uh, we get there 
um, as you can see the door is massive there's also glass panels on it but you can see they've got a curtain just for privacy so as you come into the entrance hallway you have the grand staircase and a generous um hall as well you can see they've got a couch in there but you can design it as you wish then you have a stunning living room uh, which also features mood lighting, a double aspect corner window and access to the spacious hall through oak effect double doors. The interior designer also did a fantastic job. As you can see, they really utilize the space, love all the windows in here, bringing in so much light. Um, the white uh, L-shaped couch is very beautiful. And as you can see, the room is big because the couch is not touching the wall <laughs> i'm letting you guys on a secret how you know a room is big is if the couch doesn't touch the wall so back out into the entrance hallway and we'll, we'll go straight into the downstairs wc which is also quite nice fully fitted kitted out you've got um sink in here and a toilet beautiful tiling and i like the contrast between the white tiles and the black paint wall work then you also have more storage downstairs which is needed and is required straight into the kitchen slash dining the high specification kitchen slash dining area features a spectacular double height floor to ceiling window which extends to the mezzanine on the first level allowing in plenty of light when enjoying a family meal or entertaining there is also access via um, a sliding patio door to the garden from the dining area beyond the kitchen is a separate utility room and access to the integrated double garage a clock room with illuminated mirror and plenty of storage complete the ground floor so yeah so that's a full description of what the kitchen comes with and as you can see uh, the cabinets of the kitchen are two-toned so there's the gray side then the black side which is beautiful i think black is such an underrated color i think it just makes everything look so luxurious you have the light gray cabinets with the black door handles beautiful absolutely stunning and as you can see you also have a very generous breakfast bar with um an electric hub in here lovely i just love the view from here how stunning then i love this little section where you have a little coffee coffee making section so for the coffee lovers you have your own little space and then this is the utility room as you can see high ceilings as well if i didn't mention that already then you have this extra room in here which is nice again they are just using that as a little breakout room then straight into the family area the family room to the rear features a single oak effect sliding panel door into the dining room slash kitchen beautiful well designed well thought out as you can see this family area they've made it into an office as well so you can use this um, as you wish but yeah you can redesign it you can make it um, you could even use it as a kids playroom whatever you wish so you have plenty of option this house is one of a kind very rare I've not seen a house this beautiful the upper floor is reached via a stunning staircase with oak handrail glass panels and low-level LED lighting As you can see, the landing is gorgeous, beautiful, very spacious. And this is the best feature of the property, the view to your downstairs kitchen slash dining area. Gorgeous, bringing in plenty of light. The first 
room I'm going to go into is the family bathroom. This is a four piece bathroom. You have your toilet, sink, shower and a bathtub as well. Be beautiful um, half height tiles in here. Love the chrome finish. You've got a vanity sink. And of course some storage space. You also have a chrome radiator as well. The shower is quite big. Um, you can fit plenty of people in there. Not that you're going to take showers with others. But yeah, so let's go into the first bedroom. As you can see, very spacious room. It's a double room. Uh, you've got a double bed in here. Plenty of space for storage. And you also have fitted wardrobes. So yeah, stunning, stunning space. Then you have an ensuite. Again, you have the half height tiles. Um, it's painted at the top. Then you've got your shower and a vanity sink and toilet in here as well. So this room is, it's got a window in here. It's facing the garden. Then straight into the second bedroom and my son is going to give you a little tour of this room because he really liked it. Because uh, this is the master bedroom. As you can see, it's very spacious. It's even got a little couch in here. You've got two bedside units. Um, and then, of course, you have your closet, your walk-in closet, so dressing room. You could add mirrors in there as an addition just to make the room look even bigger. Then straight into the ensuite. Oh my god! shower and tap and twins. Oh my goodness. And my very own weird looking sponge. Is that your sponge? Yeah, it's actually, it actually looks like a sea sponge. This is beautiful. I've never seen anything like this, you know? Wow. This bath is ginormous. It's like a hotel, isn't it? You're actually. Yeah, it's so much better than a hotel. Is it better than a hotel? But yeah, can we buy you this right now? So there you go. He definitely approves of this house. So yeah, so back out into the landing and there's just some storage in here. Then you have the water tank as well. Then straight ahead is the third bedroom, which is currently being used as a study. Set up as a an office, beautiful space. It's smaller, but it's a nice wee room. And I think it's definitely good for, as an office. And you've got plenty of light coming in. Um, it's front facing. And I like how they've utilized the space. Um, just giving you um an idea of what you can do with the space as well um the furnishing is lovely i love the curtains actually um float to ceiling height curtains they're very lovely are we investing in dogecoin yes tell our viewers what tell our viewers yes. tell our viewers tell them why do you want to invest in doge because it because because it's a meme it's a meme. Yes. So you trust your money to a meme. <laughs> it's a meme stock, okay. So final bedroom, isn't it? Yeah. I'm Elon Musk with his dog. So this is the fourth bedroom. I really liked this uh, room. I preferred it to the master bedroom, to be quite honest, because it's got a very large window in here, bringing in plenty of light. And it also comes with an ensuite as well. The ensuite is smaller, obviously, than in comparison to the master bedroom, but it's still decent. But I just prefer the way it's set up this particular room. Um, and in terms of space, it's quite big. It comes with fitted wardrobes as well. So you have options. I mean, you don't have to set up if you were to buy this particular house. You don't have to set up the way they've set it up. You can change it up a bit if you wanted to, but overall i think it's a beautiful home it's one of the biggest houses we've showcased on this space i think the only other house i can think of is uh I'll, i think i'll put a picture somewhere in here just to show you so you guys can watch that video i'll put the link in the description uh bar below 
um, to the house I'm talking about. It's a beautiful house that's currently on the market by um, McEwen Fraser. So this is the fifth bedroom. Again, decent size as well. And it's also got fitted wardrobes. You've got a double bed in here. So this room doesn't come with an ensuite, but obviously you can use the family bathroom, which is stunning. The family bathroom is beautiful, honestly. Um, the tiles, everything. I think for me, um, I like a bright bathroom. And I, I, to be fair, I don't actually mind even if it's dark, but yeah, here's another view to the downstairs space. So as you can see, um, I think previously I mentioned how you can keep an eye on everybody downstairs from this hall. You don't need to come downstairs to see what everybody is doing. So I just love this house. Uh, I was so obsessed with it. But yeah, as I mentioned, um, there's currently no plots available at this particular site. All the homes have been sold based on their website. Uh, but as I mentioned, you could contact them to see if they have this particular house in any other location. Um, but yeah, so the main purpose of this video was just to show you guys that you can get new builds that are much bigger, but you will pay a good price for it. Obviously, the bigger a house is and the location, the more expensive it is. This particular house was located in Newton Mains, which is an upper area. Uh, very expensive, actually. Most of the houses in that area are not cheap they come at a premium price so um yeah so it's a very beautiful house for a new build i think it is stunning oh, so house. hope you love it if you're new to this channel subscribe <laughs> and hit the notification bell so so you so you don't miss any of our videos